Renee, I'm back. So, <clears throat> I wanted to film something. First, I planned to film a tag, and then said, you know what? I'm going to do this instead. Well, this is a book talk. <coughs> Sorry. This is a book I got from the library two weeks ago, one week ago. <coughs> Sorry. No Big Deal by Bethany Rutt Rutter. I think it's a, a UK author, I'm not 100% sure. I'll link it in Dublu. But it's, as you may uh, suspect, about a teen who's overweight or fat. We never really get a sense of like how fat she is. But she's fat. Oh, so you have the picture here. So, she's big. <coughs> and at the start of the book, she laments on the fact that she hasn't, she, well, we don't know for sure, but we don't feel, I think at least she's never been kissed. She never, she actually, she, sorry, uh, she doesn't, ha hasn't had a boyfriend before, and she's 17, so she decides this is the year she's going to get a boyfriend. And she goes to one party, and then, so this is the start of the book, so it's not a spoiler. She tries to flirt and kiss a guy, and then right before they kiss, he stop. And she, this makes her think that he stops and um, he stops the kissing action because of her size. Because just five minutes before they were happy talking and no problem, no big deal. And then he just stopped. He stopped the action, the kissing. So this makes her uh, a bit uncomfortable and self-conscious. But all in all, through all the, this story, she's she has all the confidence, and she's uh, self-assured, and she loves her body. Her mom is also fat, and she her mom uh, is always well, always often trying to tell her to uh, slim down because she thinks people won't like you, like her because she's fat, which is obviously not true. She has many friends, and she has a great life. It's just as it says. It's not my body that's holding me back. It's the people that keep tell telling me it should. So she has no problem with her body. But everyone around her, or everyone, people around her, has a problem with her with her body. So yeah, it's a great book. Uh, five star. I loved it. Absolutely loved it. Uh, I would say it's maybe uh, it's a bit fun because when you read it back, you kind of expect to like get a summary of, like what's going to happen. And I suppose this book is kind of weird because it's not like there's a plot. Like it's not like she has to try to get slim by that date or try to do something by that date. Usually, a book has like a deadline. Like something's happening uh, six months in in the future, or something's something's looming in the future. Here, nothing. It's nothing like that. It's just like a look at a size of her life. It takes place from. August, the week before, the week before school starts again, and then it ends. It ends around Christmas Eve, so it takes place over half no, New Year's Eve. So it takes place over half a year, and uh, you look you get a look at her home life, her friends life, and her school life, as well as her love life, that does evolve, and uh, yeah, highly highly recommend this. It has some. Obviously, fat rep. It has uh, LGBTQ plus rep. Not a lot, but it's there. And then there's also. It's about to say was something else. Isn't there something else? Am yeah, I missing something? I'm not sure. But anyway, yeah, it's a great, great book. Great book if you want a contemporary read. Great book if you want a kick ass protagonist. If you want a fat rep protagonist, you should definitely check with it. You should definitely check this one out. It's very, very good. And also, it's not huge, so you can get through it in no time. Oh, yeah, also, uh, the protagonist in this one loves music, so there's lots of music references in it. So, yeah, that's very fun. At least, I think at least. And every chapter starts with. Um, Use music song title or a music lyric, which is quite fun. Very much enjoy that. Enjoy that. So yeah, uh, I read this 
for a diverse summer. Uh, and I didn't know about it any, at all before I found it at the library, just uh, just by accident. So I'm very, very happy I found it. And I would say, everyone, go out and read this one. Go out and read this. It's definitely a new favorite or favorite of mine. It's very good. You should check it out. Read it or regret it. Renee, out.